hi guys welcome back to my channel again so today we're gonna have another review for this box in front of you guys we have here the shodo super from bandai and it is qq sentai go go five all right so for you guys who do not know what is uh shodo super shodo super is actually a uh, candy toy type of figures from bandai all right uh, so if you say candy toy of course inside here they include you with uh, one piece of candy for you to eat or you can throw away it's up to you and then uh, uh, the uh, material for this figure is just a plastic type of figure like the uh, model kit you know the, the the plastic is similar like a model kit figure uh, like a gumpla gundam all right that type of plastic you can i mean you can really feel and then the it's just the uh, and the size of the figure is just 118 scale so it's not the same like uh, if you have a power ranger lightning collections uh, they are 112 scales all right and then same goes with uh, sh figure arts also 112 scale so uh, it's not the same scale with both of them right it's just 118 scale of figures and then uh, for Shodo super uh, for this Shodo line I mean the candy toy usually you need to apply stickers uh, for the figures or their weapons all right for this figure they come it comes with uh, lots of weapons and luckily you do not have to put uh, I mean you do not have to apply any stickers for the figures but you need to apply the stickers onto the weapons over here so I have already unboxed these things and I already applied the stickers for all the weapons I will show you guys later on in this review and what else about the Shoto Super? So oh, yeah, another thing about the Shoto Super actually, uh, this Gogo Five is the uh, second release of this Shoto Super line. All right, because the first Shoto Super was uh, Sun Vulcan. All right, Sun Vulcan is the first Shoto Super uh, that has been released by Bandai, and Gogo Five is this. Uh, it is the uh, second one. All right, okay. And the third one that will be uh, in the market, I mean, they will start to release uh, in August, which is the uh, Super Sentai Bioman. All right, this Super Sentai Bioman also include with all the accessories and weapons for the uh, Bioman series. All right, and last but not least is the fourth line for this Shoto Super, which is just announced a couple of days ago. Uh, the uh, Hyakuju Sentai Gao Ranger. All right, this Gao Ranger actually uh, comes with all the uh, six members of the Gao Ranger team. Okay, as we know, uh, Gao Ranger they have six members, including the uh, Gao Silver. So it's really nice to have the whole team together so one of the best thing about Shoto Super is uh, is that uh, you can complete the whole team together uh, without need to wait for several years or a few years uh, to complete a team of uh, Super Sentai because uh, as I mean in the past we had the uh, SH figure arts Super Sentai series we also need to wait uh, I mean at least one or two years to complete the whole team uh, same goes with this current uh, latest Power Rangers lightning collection uh, we also need to wait few years uh, to complete the whole team members but for the Shoto Super it's really awesome because you do not have to wait for a few years to complete the whole team you can complete it in a uh, single box okay so yeah okay all right so without further ado let's check on the figures inside let's go and here is the uh, 
figure themselves so you can see here the figure looks very really nice the proportion the molding absolutely fantastic all right so yeah the color the i mean the uh, pin application on the figure also looks very very nice very very accurate okay so let's check on the articulation for this google 5 let's start with the red ranger itself okay so let's check on this articulation so usually and the rest of them actually is the same articulation too okay so let's start with this first non okay let's go for his head over here his head i mean you can do a tilt a little bit and the left i mean see you can move 360 degrees so the head actually you can only move together with his neck all right it's not a separate piece between the neck and the head so it's just a single piece together it's a ball joint so you can just turn it around you can do a little bit tilt left and right all right and not really go up and down just a little bit here but you can still do a movement on the head itself so go all right that's the uh, head all right next we go to the hand articulation so the hand articulation there's a bicep swivel over here okay so this one is the uh, shoulder over here is a ball joint okay you can see that there's a ball joint and the best part about the shoulder over here they provide you the uh, butterfly joint okay you can really move here you can see the butterfly joint even though it's just a 118 skill they provide the butterfly joint okay then on top of that he has a single uh, joint of elbow all right single joint elbow okay on his wrist you can't really do much it's just a rotation over here and if you like to change the hand over here you just take it out okay so it's just a single uh, drawing there's no other uh, articulation on the, this hand all right it's just a uh, pop pop and pull inside here again uh, it's just a plastic all right so like that okay so the hand can go really up like this okay and like this okay and then like this okay that's about the hand and on the uh, torso I mean look at that they actually not not only they paint it but they actually mold the uh, design of the suit you can see this is not just a plain uh, pain application but they actually molding uh, sculpture the uh, suit very very well all right so the chest over here you there are separate piece between the torso the upper torso and the waist so the upper torso you can move around like this you can turn it left right all right you can turn it okay and for the waist over here also there's some movement it's also a ball joint you can actually twist it twist twist the uh, figure okay like, like that okay twist it around okay and then uh, that's about the uh, torso and for his leg over here okay and this uh, tight you can actually swivel okay swivel the tight over here and yeah that's a rotation over there okay so you can see right around okay you can do split really really nice split over here look at that okay very nice split and yeah and then uh, the uh, knees all right then his knees here 
it's a single jointed knee all right but even though it's single jointed and you look at that he can bend it really really well look at that i think it's single joint yeah it's a single joint probably a single joint or a double joint yeah it's just a single joint but the uh they can bend really really well all right because i think uh, the molding over here allow the leg to bend it more than you know more than 90 degrees okay and uh of course you can rotate i mean swivel over here too okay and on his ankle you can also move it around so you can go up and down tilt left and right because this is a, a, a ball joint okay it's a ball joint ankle all right you can look at inside here it's ball joint and yeah that's about the figures and then yeah this is the side arms you can just take it out and take it yeah side arms over here you can take it out like this so you can just put it back okay <laughs> so here actually you can attach uh, i think the yeah, uh stand i think you can attach a stand over here so you can do more poses for this figure Right, uh, yeah, it's a really, really nice figure, I think. Yes, even though it's just small and it feels very, very light, okay, very, very light for this figure. All right, that's the articulation for this Gogo 5 Shoto Super. So, basically, the rest of them uh, is just the same articulation except the uh, pink Gogo 5 uh she has the uh, skirt over here so the skirt here is made of uh soft rubber so it will not hinder the movement of her leg you can really go up like that so you can see inside here and actually the this skirt is uh, you know combination of two parts you can see actually you can take it out but I do not want to take it out and see so you can take it out if you want and see what's inside uh, the skirt is just the I think it's just a joint that you can uh, attach this front and the back together onto her hips I guess yep yeah that's the uh, different I mean you can see the, the uh, design for the female figure so of course the chest is a little bit different from the male and the rest is the same all right so the rest is just the same and let's go for the blue one okay look at that it's really captured the uh, go blue i guess yeah right this is go blue and we check on the go green okay it's really, really nice green you see the pin application everything is really, really nice it's really i mean the helmet also look nice because it's like a glossy glossy helmet you know exactly exactly like in the tv series right so look at that oh my god i have a little bit of uh pin defect over here but uh, it's just a minor defect it's not really matter to me <laughs> so look at that this is cool green i said the green is quite nice but because of the uh i mean in, in this video probably won't see it really green <laughs> i'm not sure so this is the uh, cool green look at that stand over here and then here is the uh, go yellow so yeah but if you guys notice uh, this is a male go yellow i mean male 
yellow ranger uh, if you guys some of you guys maybe if you watch uh, the power ranger adaptation uh, which is the power rangers uh like speed rescue so this uh, yellow ranger is uh, female i think it's a female ranger for power ranger adaptation but for the super sentai the original yellow ranger uh, is a male yellow ranger all right and uh, for light speed rescue there are six of them okay uh, there's another six ranger which is a uh, titanium ranger but titanium ranger is an, uh, an exclusive uh, ranger uh, for light speed rescue is i mean it's only in the power ranger light speed rescue it's not in the gogo 5 series so for the this set you do you don't have the uh, six ranger there's only five of them all right it's exactly like the super sentai series yes that's about the uh, figures of the uh, shoto super okay very nice they can actually do a lot of poses i really really like it all right so the side arms and yeah they actually come with a lot of accessories so let's check on the accessories so guys here are all the weapons and the uh, accessories that came together inside the box so we have here the uh, instruction manual so basically this is the instruction manual for you to apply the stickers for all the weapons and then this one is the side arms accessory which you can change here is the side arms that comes i mean the uh, molding together with the weapons and then this one m without the weapon so you can change between two of them right and here the hand accessory replacement hands for this gogo 5 so it actually comes uh, like this all right and this is the hands okay so i so they have so this pack i have not yet uh, cut it and open this up right so this is the hand for each one of the uh, gogo 5 members okay so there comes a lot of i mean look at this there's a lot of replacement hands that uh, comes together with the uh, figures so you can do lots of poses with these hands all right so this is all the hands and back to the instruction manual so this is how you can hold the uh, weapons and the instruction all right and behind here also the uh, guides for you to uh, apply the stickers for this life bird over here so this life bird actually is very very interesting uh, weapons for this uh, gogo 5 because all right let's see this life birds is actually uh, a weapons that you can combine to make as this life bird all right this weapon called as life bird in gogo 5 series i'm not sure what this call in a uh, power rangers lightning i mean sorry power rangers light speed rescue uh, but in gogo 5 uh, these weapons i mean the the uh, ultimate weapon called as the uh, life bird so this life bird actually comes in different different forms different different modes all right so this is the uh, life bird mode okay so it's it's actually can i mean it's the uh, combination of several different uh, weapons that come up until it becomes a life bird all right so here in the instruction manual you can see over here this is uh, how you can apply and this is how you can combine the weapons i mean to make as the life bird over here so this is how you change the mood from life bird to the uh, i think this life bird uh, master mode okay i'm not sure the name but this is the uh, uh, ultimate weapon for gogo 5 to 
finish off the uh, villain all right so uh, here the uh, every uh, individual weapon for Google 5 uh, from the lifebird itself from okay from this lifebird you can actually detach it and make it as the individual weapon for each one of the uh, Google 5 members they can actually uh, use this individual weapon of course this individual weapon you need to apply the attachment grip which is called the I think go grip or go grip yeah this is the uh, grip for them to apply uh, with the uh, weapons for them to hold the weapon properly so this is the grip so this is the grip all right so this is all the grips so of course the grip also come with their respective numbers this one two meaning that this is for the blue gogo -go five all right so we have two uh one two three four five so each one of them so and then this is the uh, one of the attachment uh, for the uh, life break okay and okay now let's jump to this uh, this is the side arm that i mentioned just in the, in the uh, instruction manual just now uh, over here so yeah so this is the uh, side arm that you can change with the figure so as you can see yeah the figure here so you can change this one to uh, this one all right if you want to okay so that's about the uh, side arms and of course as i mentioned uh, this figure i mean this uh, shoulder super comes with this candy this is the one that i said uh, one piece of candy you can eat it but i decided not to eat this i just keep it uh, i just want to keep it without no i don't want to eat it all right and this is the uh, another accessories this is the uh, side arm which is the, the this is called the gold laser okay so same this is for the red ranger which is the number one so this gold laser is actually comes in uh, two different mode all right two different modes we have this one is called as the gun mode all right this is the gun mode all right this is the gun mode and we have another one is the uh, stick mode so this is the stick mode so if you watch this series this gold laser can can switch from gun mode to stick mode whenever the uh, gogo 5 want to all right so this is the stick mode all right so this is stick mode okay and then we have another one this is the uh, go blaster so this is one another uh, gun, another weapon for the uh, okay. So this is all stickers, okay. So yep, this is the Go Blaster for the Gogo -Go Five in the series. It's like the uh, upgraded weapon from the uh, this one to this one, alright. So same for all the uh, weapons. It comes uh, together. I mean, it is for each one of them so this one uh, you can see the red line over here meaning is this is for the red ranger uh, we have the blue one okay this is for the blue and green all right this is green and then we have a uh, yellow and last but not least is pink okay so this is the Echo Blaster and the last one is the uh, this is called I think uh, V Blazer right this uh, is like a sword and like here uh, it's a combination like a blade and also a, it's a very long blade right so it's a blade type of weapons for the uh, go five so uh yeah it's the same uh if 
this one is for the red ranger all right and we have the blue we have uh, we have blue we have green okay we have uh, yellow so all of this color i mean this different different color is actually uh, all stickers so i already applied them all right so yes really really tiny stickers and really, really uh, for me it's quite hard to apply this you see over here it's already almost come up uh, if you guys very good in painting you can do the painting yourself if you don't want to put a sticker you can just uh, paint this all but uh, I don't think so I will, I will paint this all right and this is the life bread that I mentioned just now uh, so you can uh, detach all these like this one you can take out this head right and take out the wings take out the uh, leg the claw here to make it uh, as a weapon every every single piece of this life bird will be a weapon for the uh, go go five okay so I mean it's really nice for this shoulder line to come up with this uh, mechanism all right uh, to you know you to have this type of uh, weapons that you could combine you can detach and make it as individual weapon it's really really nice it's really really good uh, to have this uh, type of weapons and you can see over here there's really really a lot of weapons and accessory for this gogo 5 shoulder super so of course is for me it's really worth it all right this is instruction manual all right so it's really worth it for you to get get this figure uh this set uh yeah i think it's really really nice okay all right guys we have come to the end so my final thoughts about this shoto super google 5 series i think is uh really a uh, nice figure really awesome and uh it's really worth it i mean you can see the figure looks very nice it comes with a very very uh, uh, tons of accessories and weapons you can use you can post them whenever you want and with all the best thing with the uh, life bird that you can combine and you can separate it to make it as individual weapons so uh, i guess this is a very nice uh, figures for your collection if you want to have it but of course uh, bear in mind this is not cheap at all okay so i bought this uh, about uh, 470 ringgit malaysia i mean in my country uh, i bought it in 470 ringgit malaysia uh, which is around i think 120 dollars i guess so probably yeah around that price so and it, this super sh i mean shoto super actually a premium bandai item which is you it's not the regular bandai item it's a premium bandai so usually a premium bandai is really expensive but uh, for me i think it's still great uh, because yeah i don't think so that we could get this kind of figure anymore especially for sh figure arts i don't think so we could get any super sentai uh, figures in sh figure art lines because if i'm not mistaken bandai already stopped uh produce all this super sentai series for sh figure arts so uh, i think they have moved to this kind of line which is shoto super uh because they already come up uh, another i think uh, almost four teams of super sentai in shoto super so i guess they will in future they will still come up uh different sentai teams which is i think is good uh, especially i'm a big fan of the uh all the uh 
all these type of Super Sentai, the uh, like the uh, Mass Man, you know, uh, Flash Man, Jet Man, uh, Die Ranger, you know, that kind of uh, very quite old Super Sentai. So the past Super Sentai is really really nice. So I hope that this line will continue and Bandai will keep on uh, produce all the uh, Sentai series and it's great to have them uh, I mean in a complete team uh, even though it's quite expensive but uh, it depends if you really a diehard fans for this kind of Super Sentai I'm sure you still will get it but uh, it's up to you if you want to wait for Power Rangers Lightning Collection of course it will not be the same because Power Rangers Power Rangers I think they just I mean they will start only from Mighty Morphin and then keep on going uh, they will not you will be I mean you are not getting the old Super Sentai like Jackman or Must Man in Power Rangers Lightning Collection because they are not in the uh, Power Ranger adaptations. So uh, yeah, I think this is great, and I hope uh, there will be more uh, release on this line. And then uh, yeah, if you guys would like to purchase this, I think you can still get it on Mandarake website or. Uh, any ocean japan ocean website yahoo ocean and maybe uh by japan and maybe in uh buy or website so you can still get it in different ocean website in, uh, buy you can buy from the uh, direct from japan or yeah because this series i mean this google 5 is actually quite uh i mean it's been in the market for the past i think two years say maybe last year or two years i'm not so sure when they actually really come out but if you would like to get the latest one which is bioman and also the girl ranger you can still pre order and uh, from your local toy store local seller whatever so yeah but in but yeah that's all i think uh, it's really, really nice and then uh yeah we and once i get the uh the another shoro super which is bioman uh, next one i'll also do another review about it and see if there's any different on that figures we will check them out later on okay guys stay tuned and uh, don't forget to like this video if you think it's awesome and don't forget to subscribe my channel for another or different reviews about toys figures or anything uh, all right see you guys again next time and thank you for watching bye bye and stay safe everyone bye ciao